Okay, another thing is I'm making short videos, and I'm making short videos because my phone stopped um, reading micro SD cards. Now my phone um, doesn't is not a phone anymore because I can't afford to have phone service. My phone has a cracked screen. Um, I everything that I have is falling apart, so um, I don't have I can't and I don't have a way to make money. I might, might need to talk about this a little bit more because I'm not sure people understand how bad my situation is right now as far as finance, family, um, security of any type, health. My health has been, you know, attacked for years now and um, I'm not in a safe situation. So I'm still having a really hard time understanding why I've been put into this very dangerous, unsafe situation in this day and age um, and why it hasn't like there's no sign of remedy that I can see happening yet. It's very scary. Um, anyway, I don't, I don't know what I'm going to be able to keep doing and what I'm not going to be able to keep doing, but I also want to show, um, some of the, um, I just noticed that, um, I had these photographs that show some of the disfigurement here on my body from, um, directed energy weapons. So this is actually what I'm showing here is this is was taken on August 26th, and I have a video to go with this. Most of my videos from August 26th got deleted, most of the ones showing aircraft doing uh, unusual things in the sky, creating unusual cloud formations. But this one, they tried to delete. I had the photos, but they tried to delete the video that I made off of YouTube, but I had a backup that they missed, and so I was able to put it back up on YouTube. And this is the one where I talk about how I was in the shower, and I was burned uh, instantly. Well, I was, I think it was, I, I explained what happens in the video. Um, so one of the burns happened, you know, when I got in the shower, is fine. When I came out of the shower, I had a burn on my neck. I had a burn on my cheek. Um, so there's another view of the burn on my neck. Now that, my computer just did that. There's no, there's, I didn't do anything to make my computer do that. This is a screensaver. I think that's, what is that, Mars? I feel like this happening like this is a hint. Maybe at the technology being used, maybe it's somebody who's wielding the technology, so it's a bunch of space stuff. And then um, sometimes when the screensaver switches, I think that the first picture that I see is significant. So the first picture there, it looked like Mars. Okay, I'm just gonna file that away. I have family members that seem to be linked to NASA and this Mars business that they, uh, which I think is total folly and I'm not even, you know, I have a serious problem with this whole obsession with going to Mars. I think that that is our, our belief that we can wreck things and go to the next place is gonna be our undoing if we keep going down that route. But anyway, um, these weapons, I think, um, some of them are linked with the space program. Maybe that's why that just happened. So, um, and I've explained why, you know, uh, you know, we had, um, and then there's this big Nazi link, German Nazi link that seems to be, I, it's really complex because it seems like it's all linked up with European history of, you know, intricacies of European history going back hundreds of years. And I just want my human rights to be respected and um, one of the things that's really tripped me up has been these these so-called TIs that have come online saying this and that and it turns out they're all a bunch of liars and what they were doing was covering up stuff like this being done to me um, and I don't know how many of them actually have been experiencing these things but when I really try to dig down with these TIs that say that they're going to sue this person or that person over these attacks I find out that they're massive disinformation um, programs. So people like me who are actually, you know, in danger suffer a lot from that. I consider this TI stuff to be extremely hostile. It's not delusion. These people aren't deluded. They're actually um, committing fraud. So you see here some some damage that's been done to me. And so this damage around my eyes, that what that sort of light color, that appeared almost overnight, and that's appeared, um, the stuff on the bottom of my eye, I think, appeared just within the past year. The stuff on the top of my eye, I believe, I believe appeared around January 2017. 
Then you see beneath that, you see these dark circles under my eyes. My eyes have always had sort of had dark circles, but off and on. But I used to think it was maybe I, re you know, reacted to something I had eaten or something like that. But I now think that that's also a directed energy response. I think that that was caused with directed energy weapons. Um, so you see this stuff at the top. You know, I had a doctor look at that. She said, that's a cortisol deposit. That showed up like overnight. And even if it was a cortisol, even if it is a cortisol deposit, it doesn't make sense for me to have these. Um, and especially that they show up overnight. And before these showed up, I had lumps on the corner of my eyes show up, just lumps. And those lumps seem to have somehow gone, they, they're not there anymore, but you can see them on some of my earlier videos. I'll probably put some links underneath this video to some of the stuff to reference it. But um, they, then like overnight, these, these you know, weird light colored parts showed up. And then like I said, several months later, like overnight, the stuff showed up on the bottom of my eyes. This is just some of the disfigurement that's been done to my body through, uh, I get a black, a dark spot, brown spot on my nose that'll show up overnight and go away. The, you you kind of see here some small spider veins on my nose that I've discerned is also directed energy weapon related. Um, and I've also had cuts made to my skin, including a cut put on my neck instantly in the shower from directed energy weapons. There's a little bit of a, you know, sheen on my my nose here. So this is all part of the disfigurement of my body. I have a, my nose is broken. So when you see the the angle of my nose in some pictures, it's not, not on these very much, but you can see that my nose was broken. My nose was broken, I think, also through frequency-based technology as I was sort of made to zone out in a in a certain situation that didn't make sense for me to even be in that situation. I've talked about it on video. I don't know if I put the video up. Um, and I walked into a wall and broke my nose. My nose has never been the same since. And the other parts of my body has been disfigured. I'm not going to talk about, you know, disfiguring of my private parts, which was also done. I now know on purpose and because some of this stuff is satanic and very, very sick. So, um, why do people think that this should be going on with me? Why won't people help? All right, this looks like twins. I don't want to do twins. Um, I really don't know.